Hi all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Romka and I love to talk about travel, career, and general living tips. This is a quick property tour of the Warwick Paradise Island in Nassau, Bahamas. So we didn't actually stay in this resort very long because um, I felt like it was a what I requested versus what I got. I just didn't feel that it met up with the expectations that I had based on what they put on their website. And um, it just, for me, it was not the quality of resort that I would want to stay in, all-inclusive or otherwise. So we actually ended up switching to a different resort, and I will have that property tour up hopefully by next week. And then here we have the bedroom. Some of the furniture in the bedroom was metallic, and so it had a little bit of rust, which I didn't really like. Um, but overall, this is the room. We also booked a room with an oceanfront view, and this is kind of what we were given, which I don't think is oceanfront. So we went down to the veranda, which is the main dining hall. For our lunch, um, lunch slash dinner, I ended up getting some plantain, corn, rice, and peas. And then this chicken in a bag with fries. And then this is the outside of the resort in the rear. They have this one large pool and then they have a dining place that's open towards the evenings. There's also outside seating for the buffet. This is the beach that the resort has access to. Um, it's kind of small. And then there are some boardwalk areas around the back of the resort with some activities. There was a steakhouse sort of restaurant outside. Um, we unfortunately couldn't eat there because it was already booked by the time that we were getting there. I think the side that the resort was in was a little busy in the water, like around the water area was a bit busy, so we didn't necessarily get the clearest and nicest views of water from our room. The resort also had an Italian restaurant and then some additional activities and other things inside. So here's a open market display area, I think, and then the resort also had a small gift shop. This is the bar that is in the lobby of the resort and the general lobby area. So for a late night snack, we went to the poolside eatery and got some wings. So that is the end of this property review. Please make sure that you subscribe to my channel for more property tours and other content and see you all in the next video.